niggas say they on me. Get a green and they say they on me. He'll cake go from one to three. He'll cake got a need for speed. Pushing that cake, yeah, I'm feeling my Z. Getting them blues, I turn to a V. None of these dudes ain't fucking with me. Pushing that hell can't pass my Z. Crash go by me another one. Run up on me, I got hell of one. Get money, I got hell of fun. Big bird, we got hell of one. Clear as a metal goes home, bro. Border is red like a bro. Hell can't come through, better move. Hell can't go through, so. Alright, uh, what's happening, man? This is your boy Miles, man, back with another video, back with another banger, back with one of the dopest videos I've ever seen in your life. So, um, today, uh, on this video, <clears throat> this is gonna be something very, very different. Uh, y'all know me, man. I'm always doing, <laughs> I'm always doing something different, and I really do appreciate y'all because I feel safe enough to do this on my platform, you know what I'm saying? Like like I always say, y'all are like family to me, y'all allow me to be myself. You know, like even when I do videos like this, y'all never judge me or anything like that. Um, y'all always accepted me. So, this is really not, uh, this is a different video. As you already see from the thumbnail and the title, this is something I feel like I really needed to do uh, and use it on my platform as well. So, this is not for views or anything like this. I had a phone call. But uh, this is not for views or nothing like that, man. This is simply something that's from my heart. It's something I just feel like I needed to do. So, um, with that being said, man, I'm just gonna get straight to it. None of this is wrote down. This is strictly from my heart. Uh, and this is for all the fathers out there. It's not no Father's Day post or nothing like that. This is strictly for the fathers that may feel like, you know what I'm saying, the way I feel or Maybe your father, you can't be around your kid, or maybe your father that needs to be around your kid. You know what I'm saying? So, and this is not just for anybody that has a daughter, it's for anybody. It could be for a mother too, but this is coming from a father's standpoint. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and this is even for if you have a son, just place the daughter with the son, I guess. But this is officially like my letter to my daughter. Um, Bro, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna try my hardest, bro, not to cry in this video. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try my hardest. And she's over there right now. She's not paying attention to me, so she'll understand it. Hopefully, this YouTube thing will be around uh, later on by the time she's of age, and at least of age, to be able to see this video. And she's right, she's over there right now watching the Grinch. So we're getting, we finna get ready to get our Christmas spirit on. But, man, to my daughter, to. Alea Naomi Johnson. Um, I love you with all my heart. You know what I'm saying? You've taught me so much. As a man, you're only two years old right now. Today is December 3rd, and you currently making a mess with the pancake. Baby, put the, put the, put the pancake on the plate. <laughs> I love you. Um, it's a lot of stuff that you're not going to understand as of right now, as of as a two year old that you'll understand later on when you get older. But just know that I love you and I appreciate you for everything that you've been teaching me so far at two years old. But um I know that first and foremost, before I get into it, I'm not perfect. You know what I'm saying? By no way, shape, form, or fashion am I perfect. But I try to be better for the sake of you. I try to analyze myself and figure out what I'm doing wrong. And every time I'm not gonna understand it right off the jump that I'm doing this wrong. Sometimes it may take me a week to figure out I'm doing this wrong. It may take a few months, a couple months, a month, a year before I figure out, okay, I need to do this differently. Um, but I try. I do know that I love you unconditionally. Um, and without you in my life, I really don't know where I would be. I don't know where my mind would be. Being a father has elevated my grind, has elevated my drive. Like now it's like my grind is 10 times, 100 times what it was before I had you. And so now that I do have you, I know that everything I do is now, it's officially bigger than just me. Of course, it's me on the front, you know, of course, it's my brand. Of course, I love what I do, 
but I know it's bigger than just me now. I know that I can't just go out here and halfway do something because I have I have you that's looking up to me, you know, and I don't want to be another parent that's just do as I say, not as I do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not grinding for something I want, but I'm telling you that you need to grind for something that you want. Like, I don't want to do that. And a lot of times, like, this, the journey that I'm on, it's, it's not easy. And it is, and I just pray that one day they do becomes less and less more tedious. But as of right now, I'm at, a, I'm still at the beginning point to where I'm still, I'm still grinding. But the joy that I see on your face, man, when you see me, the way that you react. Stop, baby. <laughs> the the way you react when you hear like my car, I hear any loud car, like it's it's amazing just knowing the fact that you know or feel like, oh, that's daddy. Play that over there. But it's it's truly it's truly beautiful, man. It really is, and it does. It makes me very very happy. Um, you've taught me so much about patience, baby. Take the ball. Hey, 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 hey. Take the ball over there. But you've taught me so much about patience. Um, you've taught me about having a balance in my life, even though I'm still working on how to maintain a balance. Uh, but you've taught me so much about having a balance in my life. You taught me so much about having structure in my life. You taught me so much about grinding for something that you really believe in. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing to, to get taught so much from somebody that's so young that really don't even understand life yet. But yeah, she's taught me my daughter has taught me so much. So to my daughter, baby, I love you for everything that you've done for me and for the mistakes that I made while being your father. Uh, I pray that one day that you understand that everything I've done was from, was from my heart. Um, Oh man, I gotta talk like this now. <laughs> uh, but understand that everything I did was from my heart. Um, I'm not perfect, but I strive to be different every day and I strive to be better for you. Uh, I strive to be a better man, to put you in a better position in life. Um, because I know what I've been through in my life, I'm not saying that my life was just hardcore, but it wasn't. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 I have some areas where it could have been better, but I pray and ask you understand that everything that I'm doing for you, baby, is really from my heart. And I'm learning every day, and I'm not perfect, and you teach me every day. And I thank you for loving me unconditionally, even though you don't understand it yet, but you do. Like, no matter my mistakes, no matter when I have to discipline you, no matter when I do something I feel like I'm not supposed to do, or even if I feel like I may not be spending enough time with you like I should, like you still, you love me unconditionally. And I just feel that, I feel like having you in my life was one of the biggest blessings that I ever had. Um, and I'm striving and I'm pushing to be better for you. Um, and sometimes it may not seem like everything I'm doing is for you right now, even though you don't understand, but it is because I have to find a way to put you in a position of where when you grow up and you want to have your own family, have your own career, have your own life that you can understand and see all the hard work that I went through. And hopefully all my hard work pays off to the point to where you don't have to work as hard as me and you don't have to make the same. You want juice? Okay. This your last juice. And you got your water out of this. Last juice. And your water. Alright, go. You're welcome. But um hopefully that you understand that everything I'm doing is for you. No matter how hard I work, no matter how much work I put in. No matter how, how much time I put in, everything that I'm doing is for you. Um, 
I just want to be able to put you in a position to where you don't have to do as much as I had to do when I was coming up. And even right now, you don't have to, you may not have to do as much because I've put down all the hard work for you. So even though you're gonna have to still put in work of your own, but it'll be a lot different. So, come here. Ugh. But, <laughs> that smile, man. Daddy. Huh? <laughs> but baby, I love you. Uh, stop being weird. Mm. But I love you. And seeing the smile that you have right now, hopefully one day when you get older, um, you will see this video and you will know that I love you from the bottom of my heart. And without you in my life, man, I really don't know. Um, I really don't know what I would do. So I appreciate you for making me a better man and for the people that are fathers like y'all understand the way I feel like my daughter has really and truly made me a better man and it's crazy because even when her making me a better man it's like it's it's mistakes that I make and made that I know um that I, I'm just not perfect you know and so it's just like I'm still trying to better myself each and every day and it may not change right away you know like because again I'm human so I may not change right away but I am analyzing myself to change everything I possibly can to be a better man for for my kid. So the fathers know how I feel like I really don't. <laughs> what you saying? You got some juice? You got some juice. Got some? Got some juice? Thank you. But I'm striving to be a better man for this little amazing girl. I don't want no more. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. But I'm striving every day to be a better man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I will push, man, until I continue to be a better man for her. Uh, and I'm just truly, truly thankful and blessed to be a father. But I just felt the need to make this uh, letter to my daughter, you know, it's a video. I felt the need to make this letter to my dog. It was on my heart. Um, and she was asleep last night, but I didn't want to wake her up and make the video, but it was on my heart that I feel like I need to make it. And hopefully it's something that for, maybe making this video is for my daughter to see, but it may be for some other fathers that feel like they may need to reach out to their kids that they may not be able to see or whatever the case is. You know, so again, I appreciate y'all for allowing me to feel comfortable enough to even make this video. Um, but this is definitely a letter to my daughter. Daddy. <laughs> yes, baby. I get it. Huh? I get it. I get it. Uh, no, not those. <laughs> you can get your juice. No. Nope. Okay. But I appreciate y'all for watching, man. Hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, man, this helps somebody. Hopefully, it helps somebody. But I love y'all. I thank y'all. I appreciate y'all. And again, to my daughter, hopefully you will see this video one day when you're able to understand and comprehend more. I love you, baby. I love you. Let me get dressed and go. Thank you.